Grace and peace, y'all. You know, it's the end of 2022, and it's been a hard year. I spent part of this year on medical leave. Reverend Dina spent part of this year on medical leave. Reverend Jeff has spent part of this year on a much needed sabbatical. So our team hasn't all been together. We're still facing with the challenges of COVID-19. And oh yeah, our building looks like this. We have to wear hard hats around the office, in fact. So it's been hard to do everything that we want to do as our vibrant, inclusive, and progressive faith community and human rights church. Now we've been able to accomplish some really amazing things in 2022. We've relaunched some programs like Children's Ministry. We brought on a human rights director. We brought on an executive director. We got to come together as a community and march in the Toronto Pride Parade for the first time since 2019. But yeah, it's been a tough year. It's hard to do everything that we believe that we ought to be doing as the community that we are. And speaking of hard things, I think it's gonna be pretty hard for us to raise the money that we need for our year-end campaign. That's $125,000 and we need to raise it by December 31st of this year. The fact is, folks, we have done hard things together before. That's our story. The Metropolitan Community Church of Toronto was founded in an era when people did not want a church like ours to even exist. We've lived through seasons when members of our community could get into a lot of trouble, legal trouble even, for being who they are. We lived through a season when members of our community were being lost to HIV AIDS. We lived through a season when we all had to fight for uh, equal rights for members of our community. Today we're living in an age when members of our community have to flee their homelands because of the dangers they face for being who they are. This is all really hard. Many of you know this firsthand. But you also know that we have been doing hard things for 50 years. And so we're going to press forward and continue to do those hard things with faith and hope and love and with your support. We can look back on where we've been. We can see what we've come through. And so we can have faith to say the best is yet to come. The best is yet to come. And so we hope that you'll support us to make the best happen. You can go to www.mcctoronto.com slash donate or reach out by email to giving at mcctoronto.com to make a donation to support our year-end campaign and to help us to continue to change lives and to save lives. I'm Reverend Junia Joplin, and for our entire team here at MCC Toronto, I want to say thank you so much for your support.